Hello, this is Mike Mason, and I'm going to be doing the play-by-play. -play. So this is what Andy and I look like during our shared learning experience. I will say the HoloLens headsets are very comfortable. Uh, it's great to have your heads up and your hands free, and uh, really you forget that it's on your head. Uh, most of the gestures, such as this, uh, feel pretty natural, so holding your hand up so I can get to the Start menu. And here I have a choice of either choosing Anatomy X or RoboRaid. So I think, let's see, yep, I chose Anatomy X. We're going to stay on topic. And, you know, just you're starting an application, and it goes ahead and it scans the room. So this is something the HoloLens 2 will do uh, regularly. Uh, so it recognizes the space uh, for the future. Uh, it's going to help also know, you know, where the walls are, where the ceiling is, etc. So I am uh, starting the Anatomy X program, and right now I have my own skeleton and, and move them around. Uh, but Andy's over there creating another room, so I'm going to actually join his room. Here we go, room one. And the first thing it asked me to do is scan an anchor. So as you see me on the left there, I'm actually scanning the anchor. Notice you don't see a name above my head. Uh, in the corner there, but as soon as I scan the anchor, you see it says Mike right above my head. Now, uh, now Andy and I are looking at the same skeleton, and he's uh, adding, it uh, looks like a nervous system in there. And what I'm going to do here is take a look at Andy, and then I'll, I'll actually move the uh, skeleton down onto the table. And I said, move it for me. I'm essentially moving it for both of us. And I circle around. And right here, I believe I'm actually going to label some pieces of the arm. As Andy looks, uh, it's going to do some different things with the right femur. I labeled the humerus and the radius. Uh, and he actually took the bone out. And uh, this is us interacting, right? So he took the bone off, and I'm actually going to give him the bone back. So I'm throwing him a bone, literally. Now, here's really the same thing in another view. Okay, this is from my point of view. And I'm just, again, I'm grabbing it with my fists, dropping it on the table, and then walking around. Okay, so one from his point of view, one from my point of view. And you'll see the same interaction uh, with the bones here. So I'm going to label the humerus and the radius. Okay, Andy took the bone out, and I'm going to take it over and actually throw it to him. Okay, and notice it says Andrew, uh, and it recognizes him in the space. Now what's interesting here is, again, he's looking at the femur, uh, and if you look at the little info panel he has there, you know, that's a perfect opportunity for learning. It's telling him information about the femur and also the etymology of the word femur. So as you go through the, the skeleton, it's, it's, it's a learning opportunity. Now here we're going to move on just from the regular skeleton and go to something more specific. We're going to take a look at the back. Okay, it's, it's in the uh, supine position as well. And here's Andy's view of me opening up the back. And what I like here, uh, Andy's actually going to walk up. As I do something kind of funny with my hands there. Uh, he's going to walk up and take a closer look at the back. And really, it just, I think it's uh, really good quality here. You can, you know, you can almost feel like it's, like it's real when you have the headset on, uh, taking a look at the back. Hey, and then... Uh, here's just a uh, third-person view of me doing something weird with my hands uh, and then Andy walking around. So this is what's actually happening in real life. Uh, it, it almost looks kind of strange. You're so used to the hologram being there and being real. And, and really, that, that is what it's like having the headset on. All right, so again, from Andy's point of view, uh, he sees me changing the heart and expanding uh, the, the parts of the heart. And now I'm going to uh, 
put it back together and start peeling apart different parts of the heart. So I take the pericardium off, uh, I take the wall of the atrium off, and really just you get a nice close-up look here, and I'm actually looking right through to Andy, <laughs> uh, uh, th right through the heart. Okay, uh, so it's, it's really a terrific way to, to learn uh, about the, the parts of the body, frankly, this, this software. All right, and no learning is complete without a quiz here. So this is me quickly trying to go through a challenge quiz. Um, and what's interesting, if you look on the right, you actually see a skeleton, and it's sort of identifying parts of the skeleton and you're answering. So, so really the hologram becomes part of the exam as well. Uh, as you see, I wasn't really taking the test seriously. I got a 17, but um, you know, if, if I tried harder, I, I think I could do better. All right, so here's Andy closing up the, um, the session. Uh, it scans the room again, and uh, maybe I will play a little game. All right, so <laughs> here's me battling some monsters. And, you know, really this is a great introduction to our eSports segment, which is coming up next. Oh, I died there.